Five different ways people handle conflicts. Number one, the first way people handle conflicts is the lowest level. This is people who are stubborn, close-minded. I don't want to hear about it. I don't even want to deal with it. I'm purely stubborn. This person I recognize very well because that's who I was for the first 22 years of my life. I knew it all. I was stubborn. Don't tell me anything. I'm good to go. Okay, stubborn. The second level is somebody that accommodates. These are people that are passive. They confirm, oh, okay, no problem. You guys want to go there? I really don't want to, but no problem. Oh, I really don't want to do that, but I get it. I don't want to make you mad. No problem. Conform, 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 conform. Second level. It's not as bad as stubborn, but it's pretty bad to be conforming all the time. You're always accommodating. The third level is avoiding. No, I'd rather not talk to her. You know what? I can't even stand what she said the other day. Why don't you call her? No way. I would never call her. I can't believe what he just said in the other business meeting. How dare he call me out like that in that business meeting? why don't you give him a call? No way. I'm not going to call him up. Avoidance, 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 avoidance. And all of these conflicts in your life add up. You're carrying a 500-pound backpack if you're constantly avoiding conflict. You are because you're afraid of avoiding it if you are that level. Number four is somebody that compromises. You hear a lot of times people say, well, I compromise. You know, I'm willing to compromise. Babe, why don't we compromise? Some people think compromise is the highest level. You know, in marriage, you got to compromise. I don't know about that. I think you do. No, you don't. Yeah, you have to compromise. Why do I have to compromise? I don't want to compromise. Maybe she has the better choice, but you have to compromise because it's healthy for marriage. It's healthy for business. I don't think so. The highest level is collaborate. What is collaborating means? Maybe your idea is better than mine. Maybe spending the million dollars in the area that you are suggesting is going to give us 80% return on the million. Maybe my million is going to make us 40%. Maybe you are right. If I compromise, we meet half ways. I give you half a million, I keep a half a million. No, no. Collaboration means, tell me what you're thinking. Here's what I'm thinking. That's what you're thinking. Oh, okay. God. Well, I hate to say it. She's right. I want to go with your side. That's the five levels. By the way, please don't take this as me, the expert, is saying this. I'm automatically putting myself at the highest category. I've had to work to get up to this point. The bigger I wanted to get with my business every single year, I had to remind myself to get closer to collaboration and lower compromise, lower than being just a person that accommodates. I wanted to get to collaboration and it helped my business grow. So now, now that we know the five levels, you have to assess yourself and say, I think I'm level two. I think I'm level three. By the way, this is not a scoring system on whoever gets the highest score wins. You just have to be very honest with yourself. Again, address the conflict with yourself. Maybe you are level one. Maybe you are level two. And how has that worked for you? If it hasn't worked for you, then you got to change.